Hello, welcome to Spirit Cocktails. I'm your host, Pierre Rare, and today we are continuing the Tipical Cocktail Week. Today's cocktail is actually going to be based off of the Tipical Chocolate Cream Rum, which is going to be called the Grandpa's Milk. Because it tastes like chocolate milk. Get a little extra alcohol in there. Yeah, Grandpa will be sipping on that milk for a while. It's a very simple recipe. Three ingredients. Let's show you how it's made. First thing you want to do is about two ounces of your Tipical Chocolate. This is going to be a shake and strain style. So I'll take that, put it in your shaker. Then you want to take one ounce of your scotch. A little more than an ounce. Yeah, actually, potent. Then you want to do half ounce of amaretto because amaretto by itself is potent. This is something that you're definitely going to be tasting. There we go. You want to add ice and ready to shake. Good. Finally, take that and strain into a food glass. There you have it. Grandpa's milk. Now basis of this recipe is designed off of a godfather drink. Grandpa, godfather. Because the godfather consists of your amaretto and your scotch. This is add a little bit of a chocolate milk flavor to it so you're getting a little bit of that grandpa's milk. See how it tastes. Mmm. It's actually pretty good. You can definitely taste the peaty flavor of the scotch. Could be also going to put a little more in that supposed to, but you can still taste it regardless if it feels equal. And the amaretto has a nice nutty flavor to it. A lot more sweetness, because you are getting the sweetness with the chocolate. Just add a little bit more sweetness to it. You're getting a subtle chocolate flavor to that, but the chocolate and the cream blends very well with the scotch. And the nutty amaretto just kind of brings it all together. So it's actually a really flavorful cocktail. If you like scotch, this is something you might want to try. If you don't mind a bit creamier drink. And actually, it's good, but definitely you, you could taste that, that peatiness of it. A little bit of a smokiness. But scotch by itself is very peaty. This does help balance it out. It actually makes it a lot more flavorful. I had a Godfather before. I like it, but it's like you're tasting more scotch. There's a little bit of sweetness, not much. This, the milk, the creaminess, the little bit of chocolate notes to it helps bring out that flavor a lot more to give it a better cocktail overall. It's definitely worth trying out. And I hope you like this recipe. Go back and check the other recipes we made for Tippy Cow. And stay tuned for the rest of the week because we still have at least two more recipes coming and a few more reviews. And as always, like us on Facebook, slash Spirit Cocktails. Subscribe to our channel. As always, drink responsibly.